over there to the, the, the there thing. Yeah. <laughs> Just in time. And we're live. Welcome. Welcome. I'm James. This I'm is Darcy. Darcy. And you're watching Zero Page Homebrew. And we're going to play some games today. Some Atari 2600 games. Surprise, surprise. Because that's what it's all about. Having I've fun heard with that. Games. I've heard that. And I think uh, three games uh, works out pretty well mm -hmm. per episode. Takes us about uh, two hours to get through them. Bumble our way through them. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to work out what the hell to do. Um, so welcome to everyone. Um, Mostly due to a, a, a refusal to read the rules. Uh, yeah, it's... Uh, oh, let's <clears> make sure. Yeah, they can hear us out there. Yeah. If we can't, if you can't hear us or the volumes are crazy, just let us know and we can... Uh, nope, that's too far now. <laughs> <laughs> what did you I do? shouldn't have messed with it. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Is it good now? I don't, it's good. I, don't, yep. I don't think it's... It's good now. There we go. I don't think it's... We're being... Well, I'm being menaced by it. It still point, <laughs> It still looks how it looks, and it's still pointed right at me. As it should be. Yeah. <laughs> it's so we're gonna, too late to do anything about that. Yeah, it is. <laughs> so we're going to play some games today. And the games... What are we going to play, James? <laughs> we are going to play uh, Ladybug as our first game. And then we are going to play... Uh, emphasizing Lady. Oh, we missed it by a day. It was International Women's Day yesterday. Oh, they only got one day? <laughs> yep, only one day. It is sad. They need more days. Hopefully they can expand on that. The second game <laughs> we're going to play is Wall Jump Ninja. Awesome name, awesome game. And the third game we're going to be playing today is... And you're biasing me by telling me what you think of the it's game. It's terrible. It's terrible. Now I'm Low just biased the other way now. <laughs> it's mediocre. <laughs> <laughs> it's a game. It's a game. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> it may be good or bad or fine. We it, don't know yet. Yeah. He might know, but it, I don't know. It's Schrodinger's, Schrodinger's game. <laughs> Until you plug it in, it could be bad or good. No, that would that's mean true. that it is bad and it is good until uh, you true. play it. Until you observe it. Yeah. And yeah. And then it becomes either good or bad. Well, that's true. Because it could be good or bad to No, no, but you're using the could. player. The Schrodinger's oh, is thing is good that and it bad. is both okay. alive and dead. That's right. So the game is bad and good, and it depends on the player who plugs it in. Yes, we'll, that we'll go with that. <laughs> <laughs> and the third one is Anguna. I hope Anguna. I pronounce it. Anguna. Anguna? I will say... How would you pronounce it? Oh, I was going to say that the cover doesn't spoiler the game. But now that I look at it a second time, I, I have an idea of what this game is like from the picture. Well, he's got... Whereas he's, this one, I don't. Because it's, it's an <laughs> arcade machine. Because it accurately uh, uh, recreates that sort of like... 70s and 80s video game cover by which there was no information as to what the game was like on the cover. Some artistic interpretation usually. Yes. A yeah. lot of artistic license being exercised. Well, they had to make blocks into imagination. Whereas this one, you get an idea. It's a ninja. You get an idea and from I mean, the name and how he's positioned. You've got a pretty good idea. That there's going to be some ninjas jumping from walls. <laughs> Apple, Anyways. Aptly named. Uh, yes. This yeah. one, the name, no information in the nope. name, none, none at all. But he does have a lantern, yep. which suggests he's doing some sort of nighttime explorations, or perhaps just caving? in the dark, caving, caving, cave explorations. And he's got arrows. And he's got some arrows, so he might have to kill some things. He doesn't or... have a bow. What is he? <laughs> you think? Yeah, he's They no could be bow. just thrown darts. Yeah. And he does have some keys, yes. which suggests uh, that he is a night guard. <laughs> yes. <laughs> or he found the keys. Works in a prison. Um, yeah. And they're all the same. They don't have different key. Well, they're blue, green, and gray, I guess. Grayish green. Yeah. Okay. 
Let's get on with it. Let's get right. to Ladybug, which um, back in the 80s, I did play this on ColecoVision. At least it was a, a game in the arcade as well, um, but it did get, um, but never on the 2600 because it's, it's very complex. It has a lot of things going on on the screen. Um, I didn't play it enough to remember exactly everything about it. Um, and it says how to play on the back right there. Okay, but now we're going to skip that. We had a debate, we had a little talk today yeah. about whether we should read the rules or not before we play it. And we both agreed not to. No. Because that's how... Because I, we're men! Mm. We're not reading. Men don't read the rules! <laughs> or ask for help. Because when you played back... This is the part the, of the episode where James accidentally ooh. wrinkles the box. This one is pristine still. Oh. Oh. I'm, oh, it looks like I bent it previously. He did. He, pre yeah. he, he bent it now or before, one or the other. Um, but because back in the day, um, I only had, like, when you rented, you sometimes didn't get instructions, or you lost the instructions, yeah. or you bought them without the instructions, and you just or got the cartridges. you didn't buy them. Or you didn't buy them. As in, like, home computer. I mean, you would never do that. But some never. people I hear... Well, I had no money, so I either sat at home doing nothing. Actually, let's just get out the instructions. Well, you didn't have to do nothing. You had plenty of lawn to mow every day. <laughs> That's true. During the summer, <laughs> every the lawn was, single day. The lawn was so big, I did it over two days, and in within the second day, the lawn grew back. So I had to go and repeat the it process. It didn't. I was there. <laughs> it was. I mean, yeah, when you have a big lawn, if you drive over it with a lawnmower after a couple of days, you'll get a big pile of grass, but that doesn't mean it grew very much. No. I had to, I don't know why. It I had to do a golf it every course. day. Yeah. It seemed like it. I was fascinated. <laughs> I was fascinated that, like, the lawn care was... <laughs> Immaculate. Every two days. Yeah. Essentially, even though you had to work on it every day. Terrible. It was, like, I, I, was, I was just like, wow, this is, just, this is not how it's done in my experience. <laughs> I was no, like, I the parents are lucky that. if I mowed the lawn every week. It was certainly my job to mow the lawn every week, but <laughs> <laughs> whether it got done, whether it got done every week is it depends an entirely on the incentive, thing. whether it's monetary, whether it was the kit, the the stick or the carrot. Um, I think I had the, the the stick. I don't know if you had just the carrot, and you're like, I don't want that carrot. It's I don't more care like, about the carrot. It's more like. The stick and the carrot, like the carrot was just left in the fridge and the stick was just sort of like forgotten in the garage. <laughs> and, and then occasionally both would come out and be like, here, mow the lawn and here's a cookie. Well, no cookies. We didn't get cookies, but here's a dollar or whatever. <laughs> yeah. I, have I wasn't 26. beaten, though. I, 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 I realized, you were beaten. I realized, I realized for a moment there, it seemed like I was saying that I was, I was uh, beaten for not mowing the lawn, but I wasn't. So <laughs> I don't want to make any claims that are oh, false. That's good. Yeah, the label's coming up. Okay, let's get this going and see if it comes up properly. Looks like it's probably going to work. Oh, yes. Hooray! Hooray! Oh! Okay. Um, you'll note when you see it. Can they see it? Yep. Okay. Yep, see you'll it. note uh, that there's a lot less lady and a lot more bug involved in this uh, non-video game box version. I just turn it down a bit. This is like bleeding through. Okay. So let me put the box on our webcam feed. We found a pretty cool place to set that up. Oops, pretty decent. There we go. Uh, super cool. Super cool. Okay. Uh, I'll let you go first. Uh, no, I am not. <laughs> I am not no starting. Better. I'll play first, but I'm not starting with one one uh, ladybug down. <laughs> I want all ladybugs. Oh, it like starts right away. It does. That's that's really weird. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I'll play first. Okay. <laughs> I just <laughs> didn't want to. I just didn't want to. Do I need buttons? Uh, I don't think there's any buttons in this game. So this is kind of like a Pac-Man-ish clone. Oh, what? Holy jumping! But with walls, so you can alter the maze. Like Pac-Man was just like a set maze, and you couldn't do anything about it. Hey, Lady Goggles. 
Hey, Lady Goggles, uh, welcome! Yeah, brings us back, too. I love playing all these old games. And hey, oh, also, Dana VC. you know what else is different? There's no power-ups? <laughs> no, you can stop. Oh, yeah, 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 on Pac-Man, you, you had to go back and forth to... I probably would not get the skulls. No, I believe the skulls probably are <laughs> bad for me. Like, they're like sugar. <laughs> white death? White death. And the skulls are white? So you can pretend they're sugar. Sugar no! form hey, skulls. The, those other bugs can change the walls, too. What? Yeah. No, 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 no. It came up and got me. What's the point of the walls, then? I don't think so. I think you flipped the wall, and you blamed it on the bug. But I wasn't watching. Well, I blame the controller, Because I think then. the point of the wall is that you can change the maze so that you can have a safe area to be in. Let us know if you need the, the volume of the, the game louder or... Uh-oh. Oh, you just need one more. One more heart! Yes! All right. The pickle level is done, but I didn't... Did you get a pickle? I don't know. <laughs> Now, up at the top it says special and extra, and I think those letters are to spell it out. No, it didn't change. So I thought it was to spell it out. No. Oh, maybe you have to match the color of the letters, because the special is red, and the extra is yellow. Now it's yellow, so get the R. Oh, get, get it! it. Get, 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 oh, get. no! Uh, it turned blue. <laughs> Just as I learned the rule. <laughs> you can get it. I mean... Don't die because of not getting it. It's not gonna hurt you. You just won't get extra life or whatever it is. Really now it's red. Uh, now it's yellow. Yes, definitely get it. Okay, that's it. Um, the hearts are just hearts, so you can get those anytime, I think. I don't know what the hearts do. No! <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, I would, what I'm doing is I'm not good oh at God. games. I'm not good at games. I'm like, surprised. Is this, are you just now realizing I am not good at games? Because this is not new. Well, you blocked that guy. That was good. Oh, he ran into the skull and he died. Oh. So you could lure them towards the skulls. Huh. And like you, yeah. can, you can see why this wasn't made back in the day. There's like tons of changey things and lots of icons and bad guys. There's too much on the screen at the same time. Um, but uh, the amazing programmers are able to figure that out nowadays. Let's see who this was made by. I mean, this was um, this is kind of a, this is a licensed game, game because this was in the arcade. So it shows arcade cabinet mm -hmm. on the front. Um, and it has, says Coleco right on the front. Um, 1981, it looks like it came out. And... Come on, come on, come on, T! Yeah! Excellent! Oh. Three more to go! So this was... Coded by John W. Champo. Champo? Champ Champo. Probably French. Champo. Graphics by Nathan Strum. I've seen that name on the boards here and there. I seem to remember that name. Music and sound effects by Do Bob DeCrescendo. Manual text adapted by Nathan Strum. Manual layout box and label design, Nathan Strum. Box production, Mark Obenhauser. And produced 2015 by Atari Age. So this was put out uh, three years ago by Atari Age. But those like green ants. I was gonna Picks. say. Faster than, faster than you. Than me, right? Quite I, a bit faster. Uh, you gotta use the walls to your advantage. Oh, oh the my game turn. is over. Uh, Beat 11,920. What level did you get to? Three. three. Well, it's part three. Part. <laughs> <laughs> Not level three. Part three of the saga of Ladybug. Yeah. I'm just gonna lean back oh, now yeah. and relax while you suffer. So there's. Looks like arcade mode, advanced mode, novice. Yeah, so three. So I'm going to stick with arcade. Mm -hmm. That's not too easy and not too hard. X. Oh, yep. Yellow. Ah. Uh. Okay. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I felt about it. I but gotta, when you do oh. it, it seems excessive. Get a yellow. Oh, yeah. Woo! X and yellow as well. Uh. Yeah. Right. 
Wait, now, why am I cheering for you? You're doing better than me now. Now the S, I need red. So, I need, oh, I see, because it's in special. Oh my god, it changes so fast. I don't want blue. I want red. Red S. Is there a time limit? I is think that what that green thing is? The green border? No, uh, didn't quite. I don't think it was, because the border didn't quite run out when it changed. Okay. But something to do with the green border is time. I don't know if you can die because the time runs out. Or it's each time it runs out, a bug comes out to get you. Oh, yes, yes, that makes more sense. Uh, I need to concentrate on the right-hand side. Oh, he got eaten by a skull. How many bugs are there? Like four? Is it like Pac-Man? four bugs? Or four ghosts? Bugs in this case? Get out of here. <laughs> you told him. I did, and he got out of there. Of course I've left these ones where they're right around the baddies. Yeah, but you can go right into the baddie zone. Without they dying. Don't, they won't eat you. They're apparently. like dormant. Yeah. Uh, like T. Makes me happy. E and R. R. L, I need red. I'm going to hang around the L here for a second. Is there a pattern to the... Get it, get it, get it! Oh, oh my god, the red, red is, is so short. Is. This is definitely an oh my god moment. <laughs> I need the E to be yellow. No, oh, not red. Oh, yeah, oh I yeah, can't. Yeah. I can do red. So E is red or yellow. Oh, there's baddies around. The... Okay, I'll just... L, I need red. I need to be, like, right beside it for it to work. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes. It's going to be very hard to get all of special. It better be pretty special. Ha 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 But is there like... I wonder if there's an absolute time limit or you just overrun by bugs eventually. Carries over from level to level. Oh, oh wait. I thought that was the last one. And part three. So I need an R. There is no R, so I need these when they're red. But, but there's no matter. that one doesn't matter. A yes. needs to be red. S needs to be red. Oh, those are fast. There's a big increase in speed. That's why I died on this level. It's not because I suck. Oh, that one died. Excellent. Ate some poison. This is the carrot level. So I've got all the letters. Oh, the hearts give you the bonus. So, it's actually best to get the, the hearts right away. Oh. I think. Did that just go up? No. Oh, you know what? I think it has to be the color you are. Huh? To get the multiplier. Because it did, it went from two to two. It didn't go up to three times. Oh, it's a blue. Oh my god. So the two times is blue right now. We'll try it on the next level if I make it. Oh, there's the carrot. Oh, that's why it's so hard to get the, the carrot, because it's where the beasties where dwell. Where they live, yeah. I should go right away for that. Yes. Actually, that's a good tactic, to go right away for the ones around their cave. Okay. I just need an R. So T-I-E, are those the letters it's offering me now? I see. Okay. So the multiplier, see it got, went blue. So now I need to make sure that the hearts are blue. There we go. And one more. Whoa, 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 whoa. There we 
we go. Five times. Okay. Now I understand. Red eye. Now this one doesn't matter. Because it's already got the T. Now I can just go for it. On radish level? It might still matter because it might be like a heart. Oh. Maybe, yeah. Oh, God. That saved me. Yeah. And I didn't go for the ones around me. The bad guys. Area. No, it doesn't that. matter Not because the they, um, they still, like right now, is oh, a good time because that's true. it's between them. Yes. Although it's good at the beginning because you know it's between them. Yeah. That so you were right. Ah. Uh oh. The thing around the border is when they release. That's what I thought, but yeah. last time it didn't look like it. Maybe it has to so close watch it and fill. This time. Oh, like go around and then come around again. Yeah. So yeah, there it goes. And now it's coming back. And I'm going to finish before it does, but we'll see it the next time. Okay, RPE. So uh, there is an R, so I need a yellow R. I'm going to get the ones around there area. And, oh, that's close. I won't wait. I'll get the heart. Heart, uh, P, I need red. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Red. Excellent. Now the other heart, I need uh, blue. And blue. Excellent. Now the E, I need red, and it should turn red after this. And the R, I need yellow, and I should get an extra man. In between thing? Oh, it was nice. Just... And you finished the level. Oh. So you want to do it last then? Yeah, because you it's much harder. Um, on the new level, so this is going to be much faster. So the extra has reset. So the I maybe wait till it's blue. Oh, yes. No, it didn't. So that doesn't, doesn't do anything. And things sit on the blue the longest. Red then yellow. Ah. Yellow, yep. Yeah. Okay. Oh my goodness. Now it is getting challenging. Oh. One guy left. Obviously, this game was playing off the success of Pac-Man, or the Pac-Man genre. It's a mazy game. Yeah. Now I need that to be yellow. And this is a... Oh my goodness. Yeah, I left that area for last. Perfect. Dead. And you only quadrupled my score, or <laughs> nearly quadrupled my score. <laughs> Although, to be fair, you learned from my play, and you knew what to do. Learned from all the excellent moves. I should Kay. just shut up, because now, now when I still fail to do well. Let's see what's going on. The game, Lady Goggles. The game, the game, oh, can't. The game actually, oh, uh, the game actually seems kind of cool. Wish I could hang around, but I have to run through you guys to follow, so I can catch you next time. Bye, Sim. Fred. Ah, so you're a rant person. Drex, don't know why that auto-corrected to Fred. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> well, thank you for hanging out. And I was like, how does he know that? How does he know about Freddy? Freddy. <laughs> or she. <laughs> Freddy the kitty. So, let's read the instructions now. See if we can get any insight. Uh... Lady, it's a oh, big let's book. Back. That's a lot of writing. <laughs> that is. We'll skim. We'll skim through it. Oh, that's not on camera. Actually, we'll, we'll just keep it on this because that's more interesting. 
Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Based on the exciting Universal Arcade game, Ladybug features a fast-paced adventure. Use strategy to steer your Ladybug through a maze, dodging hun hungry predatory in insects. You use turn styles to change the maze and block their pursuit. Ladybug gathers points and bonuses by eating dots, hearts, and vegetables, and by spelling words. But avoid the deadly skulls. How many points can you rack up before moving on to faster action? And then there's some old school instructions how to set up your game system. <laughs> um, use a left controller. Uh, red button is not used during gameplay, so that's fine because we didn't press it. Uh, novice arcade and advanced. Um, so arcade is like the arcade game, about the same level. Player score, hearts, ladybugs, letters, predatory insect, they call them. So they're all insects. Um, she's hungry. Eat as many dots as possible. Red hearts and letters are worth the most. Okay. Watch the color of the hearts and the letters the ladybugs eat. Okay. Multiplier score. Eat what? Eat one blue heart and double your score for the rest of the play level. Eat another blue heart and your score triples. Eat a third blue heart and your score will be multiplied by multiplied by five, which we mm -hmm. figured that out. Uh, extra. Uh, when you spell extra, you automatically finish the maze and earn a bonus ladybug. We got that. Eat the letters when they spell the word special in the special bonus indicator. When you spell special, you automatically finish the maze and win a vegetable harvest bonus screen and a chance for extra points. Eat as many vegetables as you can before the time runs out, then move on to the next level of gameplay. So it's actually a special. I guess it's a special screen. It should maybe be bonus, but because it's like a bonus level. Step seven, the chase begins. But uh, bonus isn't as long as special. Yeah. So they don't want special. the bonus to be too easy. Yeah. Otherwise, it's a freebie, not a bonus. <laughs> That's right. It's, it's really special, special <laughs> when it's as hard as special. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Carry on. <laughs> when the timing border changes colors completely, a predatory insect be leaves the bug box to chase ladybug. We knew that. Uh, avoid by staring through the uh, turnstiles. Um, be careful if a predator follows ladybug closely enough. It could slip through the turnstile and catch her. Well, you're pretty much dead at that point anyway. Um, use your skull. Yep. Yeah. So draw them to the skulls. Vegetable snack. After all the predatory insects have left the bug box, a vegetable appears there. Yeah. Guide your ladybug into the box for a feast of points. The predatory insects will stop in their tracks for a few seconds when you eat the vegetable. Mm. I guess that's, that's pretty good. It's a couple seconds. Uh, if a predatory insect is eliminated by the skull, the vegetable is immediately replaced by the eliminated insect. Yeah, it's like yeah. eating the the power pellet for Pac-Man. It, it uh, goes back to the home base. Yeah, yeah. Um, going to a new maze. Yes. Starting over. Yes. Changing the game. Oh, okay. Left difficulty. Um, the speed of the ladybug. B is normal, which we have it on. And A is for players looking for even more of a challenge. No. No. <laughs> Use the right difficulty to change the color of the maze. Oh, okay. Hmm. Interesting. Green is good, though. I don't know if... Oh, just... Oh! Purple. Purple's nice. No, it's good. It's green. Oh, there's gray or purple. What? Weird. That's weird. It did change it. <laughs> yes. It didn't say it would stay that way. Yeah, it kind of goes back and forth between the gray and the, the purple. It may be a thing of the, the, the flicker. Uh, and that is about it. There are only blue hearts, but I... Oh. So if you get the heart when it's yellow or red, it's just nothing, I guess. It has to be blue. Eating a blue heart multiplies your score. Luckily, they're blue for most um, of the time. But it did say... gives you more points. So if you're going to eat the hearts first, make sure they're blue. But if you're yeah. going to eat them last, make sure they're red. Yeah. Okay. And there's... But there's only three hearts. Yeah. So... 
and you have to so use you choose to multiply them or to give you bonus. So about this release, Ladybug is based on a popular universal arcade game of the same name. It was never commercially released by Coleco for the Atari 2600. I bet they kept it all to themselves on their own Coleco vision. Uh, Ladybug was featured in one of Coleco's Atari 2600 catalogs. Oh, so they're planning on it. But no actual game ever been found. In 2006, programmer John Champeau of Champ Games took on the challenge of creating a version of Ladybug for the Atari 2600 and has remained one of the top-selling homebrew games at Atari Age since it's released. This Coleco Collector's Edition, with the box, is a nod to the Coleco's original intent to create an Atari 2600 version of the game and intended to give an idea of what it might have looked like. The game itself is the same as the original Champ Games version except for a few small changes. Oh, so this is special. The Ladybug arcade logo added to this title screen, which is on there right now. The Coleco added to the title screen, which is on there. Serial number added to the startup screen. Oh, uh, wow. That's cool. So this cartridge is like unique. It says 26 on the back of the cartridge. I didn't see 26. Let's just restart it. And it just starts right away. <laughs> you have to die. You have to wait to die. Well, we'll wait. Um, standard difficulty renamed to arcade. Okay. Option added to change maze color using the right difficulty switch. Okay. Very, very cool. Okay. So it is your turn. Nice try. You're always. You're always. <laughs> I think it defaults to arcade. You want to stay on arcade? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to go for super difficult next time. So you got the multiplier. Do you like the purple? Or do you want me to switch it back to the gray? You don't care. <laughs> don't try and trick me. I'm barely staying alive as it is. Okay, wait till that is red. It's very hard. You have to be right next to it. Right after this, it's going to turn red. Get it, get it, get it, get it. All right. And now the last T, you want yellow. No! Died. You died it. Yes, clear out that area. Wait till it's blue. There you go. Wait till that's yellow. Right after the blue and the red. And then now. There you go. Okay, clear the blue. I'm surprised the bugs didn't have names in the manual. I guess just figure out your own name. Those uh, are they're gross bugs. <laughs> the gross, creepy, crawly bugs that want to kill That's you. Right. Those are like beetles. Part two, eggplant. XSA. And like those with the big bulbous eyes kind of look like praying mantis, I would say. Yeah, I think so. So you want blue hearts? And the A you want red, and the S you want red. The X is yellow. No! Oh, he slipped through the turn style. No, he turned. He turned before I went down. Oh. He just randomly turned. I was not <laughs> expecting a random turn. I was reading up on the movement patterns of Pac-Man characters. There. And each of the pac Four Pac-Man colors have different ways of pursuing you. These guys are kind of random. Oh, we made it, just made it through. I just, I just flubbed the control. And <laughs> went the wrong way. Poor me! Poor you! Blue and yellow. So you can get those. It, yellow stays for you. There you go. I wonder if the colors are timed up with the thing going around the edge. I bet they are. I think they are too, yeah. Oh. Look at that, uh... What? 
My camera says internal temperature high. Allowed to cool. That's weird. Oh, a little hot. So, you can't see us right now, but we're still here. We're still alive. We're still going. I'm still playing. Denise and Darcy's still playing. No. Oh. oh, it didn't matter. It didn't matter. You had both anyway. And blue. And that one doesn't matter. Oh, but red is better. Red. Oh, because it's the least. Well, shortest one. Okay, that's easy to remember. And these are kind of like praying mantises as well. They look like ticks or ants. Yeah? Oh, yeah, the ants. You got a better score than last time. Which is good. I did. My turn. Um, so our camera, our main camera is off right now because it overheated. It didn't do that last time, which is... There you go. We're going for our backup camera. Which is a webcam. So you can see us in the left, lower left. The... Um, our mouths will be off, but our mouths are so tiny that you can't see it, them anyway. So I'm going to go for advanced. You don't need to brag about it. <laughs> <laughs> Just stayed in a fact. <laughs> <laughs> so the A, T... I need yellow. No blue. Ah! I pressed down. Didn't give me anything. Oh point. my god. You're gonna die. Oh, that's so way too fast. So what happens when you do advance and you're all <laughs> cocky about it. <laughs> that was a problem. Okay, so the eye, I need red. Oh, I need to be right near it. Oh, look at those bugs go. They're like... There you go, go. Oh! oh. You're looking at the speedy bugs. I was. So warned you when a new bug comes out. I don't know if you can hear the cats upstairs, but they're going crazy. Oh my god! This is the first level. I know. <laughs> Advanced Focus. is way too advanced. Focus! <laughs> I think I like the arcade. It's the right, uh, right balance. It, arcade seems like advanced to me. <laughs> <laughs> well, technically arcade is there to eat your quarters. So... They do want you to die. Yeah. In the arcade <sighs> Whenever I used to play in the arcade, it always seemed that it was never worth my quarter when I put the quarter in and, and played till I died. It was like, that was not long enough. But like this this game on the arcade, I would be somewhat satisfied with that amount of playtime. I was never satisfied. <laughs> I always thought it was worth 800 points. Yeah, true. Because it was red. And these only give you 10. That's it, you're dead. My turn on advanced. <laughs> 6,090. Let's see how you Not do. Not good. I'm going to see if I can... You're not sorry. You're trying to sabotage me. Uh, can I do both? <laughs> you could. Be sorry to sabotage? That doesn't work. Get the dots around the... the baddies. Wait. It was too long. Too long. Yellow. They just make a, ah! a straight blue line for you. Die, 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 die. that's going around the border. Mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't 
watch it carefully enough, but I think it, ah! it loops. It does, yeah. Timing but loops I saw the colors change in like mid point before. Oh, really? Okay. No! Trapped between a <laughs> skull and a murderous Dying. insect. Dying either way. Did you beat me? I did. It's just how it is. Sometimes uh, you get beat. Sometimes you get beat. Sometimes Darcy doesn't lose. <laughs> Sometimes he win. RPE. RPE. So you want the R and the E to be yellow. I did get a higher score than you, so you I retire. <laughs> retire <laughs> from the advanced. So let's get this camera up and going again. I don't know how I'm going to keep the temperature low. Just blow on it. We need an, a third person to just... <laughs> just fan it the whole time. Okay, let's get it going again. Oh, oh, it just... Oh. It's good I don't have to mess with anything except the one button. Is it going to come back? Yep, there we go. Hooray! I like it's a camera <laughs> with a camera. And a camera in it. Camera inception? <laughs> Look at that camera. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, let's get back to there. Okay, we're going to move on to the next game, which is Wall Jump Ninja. Ah, yes. Well, there you have it. There you have it. So, let's open this up. Um, we can. I'm not going to do that no. because if I wrinkle it, <laughs> it's over. I might not be invited back. No, because there aren't any of those <laughs> to buy. If you wreck it. <laughs> but if if you wreck it, it is okay because it's your yes, game. That is. So those are the rules. It's not hypocrisy. It feels like it, but it isn't. Those are the rules. Let's put that back in there. So, I have played this game quite a bit. Um, so, I do know how to play it. Let's get that. Oh. The icon. Icon, yes. I do need to switch it as well. Thank you very much. Uh, if you want to plug that in, now I will switch the game icon to the second one. There we go. Yep, that's the right way. Is it tight? Uh, let me go for it. Beep. Oh, that's good. Okay. Wall Drum Ninja. From Wallaber. Wallaber? Okay, so. Oh! Went away from the title screen. So there is lava and no lava. Oh, is the color black and white? There's lava and hard. Let's not do hard. Let's do lava. My, I need to clean this switch. Obviously. <laughs> oh, that's why it was going back and forth. You don't want lava? We want lava. We want lava. <laughs> you don't want lava. <laughs> this is abuse. This is Darcy abuse. So do you want to play first? Ah! Do you want to play first? Or do you want I, me to play first? I traditionally you play first. I'm sacrificed as the first player. <laughs> sacrificed uh, to the lava gods this time. All right. Now... I'm doing really good on my room 11. <laughs> you are. So it does keep track of best. I you picked up right away. It is a one-button game. Which is cool that... This is probably the... Oh! Oh! But lava! <laughs> and there is only one life. So you can go again. I got to room 7. What is that light? It's coming to kill you. 
But I'm already dead. I'm in the lava. <laughs> and it did stop where you died in the lava, so it's kind of, I guess, Scorching eating you. you. Scorching you beneath the lava. This is probably the best one-button game that I've ever played. Because there's ones like Flappy Bird, which is fairly tedious. Um, actually, there's there's some... You gotta get out of there! <laughs> yeah, but I also need to not fall in the lava like you did last time. True. And then there's ones like Endless Runners, which is... This is similar to, like, an Endless Runner, but Endless Runners are, like... Actually, some of those have more controls where you duck. And so it's more than just a one-button game. Ah, uh, get up there! Uh-oh. Oh! Okay, my turn. So you made it to room 13. And those those letters, just like in every other game... Um, oh, you want them. You want them. What is this obsession with spelling? <laughs> A lot of spelling back in the day, wasn't there? <laughs> I don't know what they actually do for you, because you only have one life. And there are no points in this game. Makes you invincible? For a while? I don't know. Best is 13. And this game is really... has really cool graphics, I think. Um... Yeah, they are entirely sufficient. <laughs> oh, that's, that's good. usually what you need in a 2600 game. Woo! The ninja's animation is, is pretty cool. Um, and it's very responsive. And the lava... Lava movement at the bottom. Oh, my God. How do... Oh, I know what it... I don't even know how I could have done that one. Gone way to the bottom, jumped just below the spikes, and then over? I guess. Because I went down to the spikes, jumped, and I hit the top wall. <sighs> and I'm pretty sure this game is random. So would it it's set the same you... every time. Would it set... Is it? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So obviously there is a way to defeat that level then. Is it the same? Yep. Uh, I haven't seen the end yet. There's oh, okay. There. So the heights? No, the heights, yeah, the heights are different. Are the same. Mm. They were the same when I did. Oh, God. That's all I can tell you. Okay. This is the one. Right? There we go. Okay, it was that. Yeah, that is the one. So they are the same. Ah, uh, I want that eye. Haha. <laughs> Ooh! New colors. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. So I've made it out of the... the lava pit? Does it seem like the red was inside the... volcano before? Good. Oh no, there is a... Oof. There is a roof. <laughs> okay, I'm at J. I just need an A. Damn it! Room 37! You got electrocuted. Oh, what's that thing at the bottom there? How far you are in the level. Oh, in that stage. Yeah. Okay. 37. How many times did you play? Two times, Twice. I think. Yeah, yeah but I made more. really far. Okay. Three times. Three, three times? Three okay. lives. It's like you have three lives. Okay. Because this looks like it's inside a volcano with all the red stuff. But even when you make it to the next stage, there's still lava at the bottom. It's like you're in the outside, but... Th what? Oh, your third game How can you even prevent that? I don't... Well, yeah, you just do it better. <laughs> just, just get good. <laughs> just do it better. I don't think we're missing anything in terms of instructions, except for what Ninja does. No, your little bar is not increasing at the bottom. Yeah, not that far. Oh, that's, I think the, it's the, ninja. that's the letters, yeah. 
Maybe it gives you an extra of life? Like if you get hit? And if you miss the N, are you screwed? <laughs> like, will you never be able to spell it in Ninja, or does it loop, loop around and you get another chance to get the N? Nobody knows. Nobody. Nobody knows. And like the responsiveness is so good in this. Like it's just perfect. Such a simple concept too. Oh, oh no, no, I knew I was dead there. Oh yeah. You have to get more than just barely. Because you didn't even have a chance to do anything else because if you went lower you go into lava. Yeah. So you almost have to almost anticipate. Like, how can... Well, the map is the same every time, that's how. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's how they can get away with that. Okay, let's read the instructions, actually. I want to... I think we pretty much know what's going to happen. Like, know everything about the game. Love the graphics. Yeah. The artwork is very cool. Let's just switch over. Dark. Is that light? Can't get too close. The delay. Oh god. I hope our I hope our mouths are working with the sound properly. Me too. Because <laughs> that's frustrating. Little ninja. Introduction. As a ninja, you already have many skills, but there are many more to learn. Today you will learn the legendary Hold. technique. Hold What Hold the jump higher. Okay. We didn't know that. You will learn the technique of wall jump. Use it wisely or face certain. I think doom. I've only done holds. Sorry. Go on. Adjust the difficulty to your liking. Press fire to begin your training. Press fire to wall jump. Hold to jump higher. I think I've always been... I am I think I might have been jumping higher all the time. Because you were this tap it? is just straight across, it seems like. Oh, that's very helpful. Avoid the spikes. Yep. Collect ninja to use your ninja dash. I don't know what that is yet. Do not let the death beam hit you. Death beam. Um, lava. When lava is off, you can use your teleport ability to zip back to the top of the wall if you slide too low. Oh, so he wraps around. Okay. Mm. Toggle hard mode on or off. Hard makes the spikes and other obstacles start much sooner. Yeah. I guess. You start later in the levels. Uh, how to win? Jump through the room exits. Achieve a new personal record. If you have Atari Vox, Atari Vox Plus, or Save Key, your records will be saved between sessions. I really got to dig that out. I do have an Atari Vox. I don't know where it is right now. I got to get that. Um, some games, it actually adds voice to it. Mm. The game. It doesn't sound like it does to this one, but um, uh, your rec high, high scores will be saved. Um, restart the Atari with the fire button to reset saved scores. Uh, credit and thanks gave development by Wallaber in 2014. Label and logo artwork by Corey Kramer. Special thanks to the Atari Age community for their support and encouragement. So we didn't know the hold and the tap. And it doesn't say what Ninja Dash does, but I bet it fast forwards you like 10 levels or something, maybe? Hmm. So. Let's try this uh, hold and tap. Because I don't know what I was doing. Pretty sure I was tapping, but... Yeah, I don't know which. Uh, just the picture looked like a tap kept you at about the same height. Uh... Yeah. Okay. Oh, oh, wow, okay. Okay, yeah, so... That's a The big... longer you hold it, the further you jump. That's a big game changer. Yeah, that helps. <laughs> That would have helped me with these difficult spikes. And also there. So I can jump higher than the spikes. Sometimes it pays to read the instructions. Well, so far it hasn't paid. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Uh, short tap. There you go. Skills. Yes. 
informations. Yeah, it kind of stops getting higher when you let go of the button. Like yeah. you can dictate. It's yeah. not a on or off kind of thing. Yeah. Oh god. I should have used a tap. Yeah. Because when you hit the ceiling, you don't keep going. Yeah, you, you slide down at the next wall. Yeah. One more. Just need the A. Then we know what the ninja dash is. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Ah! Ah! Oh! Is that oh! A, is that a nine? 39? Thirty-nine. Okay, so I did get two better than last time. Death beam. <laughs> it's coming. Ah. I don't know that you need a death beam. <laughs> no. It, it doesn't really affect what's happening. I guess they don't want you to just go jumping back and forth. Why? For too long. You might have fun doing that. <laughs> That's true. I say no, no death beam. Lava, lava seems to be, like, much better. But death beam oh. seems unnecessary. Yeah, almost. I mean, it does add that extra yikes <laughs> factor that keeps you going. There's no yeah. slowing down. I guess I just find yikes very e quickly and easily compared to other people. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh just want an A. I just want to get the A. Is that all you want? I just want that. <laughs> All I want. <laughs> That's what killed me last time. Wanting the A. Wanting the A. This one's. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> you made it too further. Like right there. I bet it's right there. Anybody else? Hey, Arena Foot. <laughs> well, Jump Ninja. Awesome game. Yes, it is. And it's not as easy as I thought it would be. Um. There you go. Did you I go get, ahead and talk. Did I get my? Th <laughs> go ahead. You only did two, but you played. Uh, you're talking. I played. I'm awesome. not playing, and uh, I need to play. Well, I'm gonna play. <laughs> Arena cool. foot. Can you tell tell us if uh, our talking is synced up with our mouths, like this? Is that synced up? <laughs> our clapping. Please let it be synced up. My high record is 47. Oh, six away. I got 41, 43. What did I get last time? I didn't get 47. I you didn't surpass 41. that. 41. 41. Okay. So I have to beat 47 because he posted it. <laughs> My highest was 13 until now. Oh. oh. So no, you're doing it's higher than 13. Small jump. There you go. Oh! No! But, <laughs> but you, did, you did better. Yeah. 23. Uh, volume is too low. It is synced, but the volume's too low. Okay. Uh, I can fix that, actually. I can fix that. Thank you for letting me know. I can fix that. Thank you for letting me know. Very helpful. Up the microphone here. No, Death Wall, why you do this to me? <laughs> hey, your turn again. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I have boosted it up and now I can, we can hear ourselves. Oh, that's exciting. And now I'm going to turn up the game a little bit as well. This down. Yep, yeah, he's doing that. 
There we go. Okay. Hopefully we can still hear the game. Nope. Oh god. Okay, I can't hear the game. Um... Oh, you died. That counts. <laughs> you you count. died in room two. It does not count. Worst game. <laughs> <laughs> okay, can I hear it now? I can't hear it. What have you done? You died again! Room one! Worst game! Yeah, you're just getting worse and worse at this. <laughs> <laughs> just slid right into the... Whoa. Whoa. See that? I did. <laughs> I think that's getting hot. Okay. We could switch back to the other camera. <laughs> uh, we'll wait till it dies. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent idea. Let's wait until it's reached, like, the critical maximum mass. critical mass. And... <laughs> For a second there. Oh, good spot to freeze. What froze? Who froze? Who's frozen? Oh, well, because it, it takes the last frame oh, of yeah. whatever's... <clears throat> I can't hear the game coming through the speakers anymore. Why oh, I know, I know, I know why. I know why. I made a mistake. Okay, press, press the button. There we go. They're independent. Okay, good. Okay, we're back on track now. The game is fine. Leave it there. Awesome. Good, good, good. What are you playing? I'll let you. Well, you played twice. <laughs> Not really. Yeah, well, you, game you died on, on room two and one. I, my <laughs> crappy games count. I don't know why yours wouldn't. <laughs> okay. So what did you get to? 20-something? 20 23? Maybe. Maybe. Who's, who, who keeps track of such things? <laughs> Freaky game. Dana! Freaky. It's awesome. Uh-oh. Is it freaky? Uh-oh. It's scary. And you said uh, that was not a problem. Room four? No, I didn't say it wasn't a problem. I said it shouldn't exist. <laughs> room four? Yes, that's bad. Is it as bad as room two and one? No, it's not! <laughs> no. But I wasn't even looking and I got to room two. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> you were looking. <laughs> looking the other way. <laughs> okay, I gotta beat Arena Foots. Oh, 47. not doing like that. Yeah, 47. No, I never meant that the death wall would have no effect. What yeah. I meant was you don't need it to feel stressed out about jumping oh. in this game. Oh, God, no, you don't. That's for sure. But I know people are always looking for, like, I don't know, something. More scary. The thing is, if you were playing this game well, you're never going to run into the death wall. Maybe later on it becomes more of a factor. It's only if you suck. If you, like, miss... <laughs> that uh, you have a problem with something like that. Well, if you miss... A jump. That's just the end? Oh my god. No, it's the second end. Oh. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> I, thought, no. I thought, what the hell? Quite alarming. It was very alarming. Uh-oh. Ah! Oh, you, have a, you go again. You oh. go again. Yes. <laughs> it's down uh, two plays per play, though, now. Two? Okay. Um, Arena Foot, did you get the A, the ninja, A, um, when you got the 30, 47? Was it 47? Because I, I, I had a feeling I was close to, what are you holding up? <laughs> he asked about the cartridge. It seems oh, to be a white cartridge. Yeah, it's a kind of Coleco, standard Coleco... Saxon? Used white? I can't remember. It's limited edition. It is the limited edition. It is. It's very limited. <laughs> I don't know and what to. Uh, what was my number on it? 26. 26? So there's at least 26 of them. <laughs> I always try and get them when it's like... 
when they first come out because there's the boxes and everything and you get the nice packaging sometimes you miss it oh god like the J now I will never know <laughs> maybe the next one will be a J probably oh, not probably not but uh, yeah it is now I have to wait longer to get the A oh muffin oh god what is that thing Whatever it is, I avoided it. Some sort of fish. That's what I need. That thing. <laughs> Things that move while I'm moving. I beat you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh! Woo! That's exactly what you said. Whoa. Ten. Yeah, but you've, you've jumped far enough ahead that you <laughs> can't, can't continue any further. <laughs> 58! We have number 72 of the ladybug. Very, oh, 100 made. Very, very cool. So that was two. Room 58, and it's on video. Nobody, uh, nobody. nobody cares. <laughs> I bet Arena Foot does. Nobody likes you. <laughs> 58, yeah. Whoop. Oh. I mean, I almost died immediately after going that far. <laughs> like, I think I died like on the second screen. Like, I warped to 57 and then died on 58. It gets a lot harder. Like, they just leave a tiny bit of room to jump way up there. Yeah. That's what I was saying is that like, you reached the level, like you got it and then you skipped ahead 10 levels and then it was like, yeah. you got 10 levels and now you are beyond your ability. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> At, at the Portrait Retro, Retro Gaming Expo, they have the World Ch Tetris Championships. And they play for score? I think it's score. And these guys do a very strange pattern. Like, it, it's counterintuitive, some, some of their things. But they... But they do it because at certain times, it speeds up. So that's kind of what this was. It's like... Maybe you yeah. don't want to jump ahead that fast because you're going to die immediately without getting all the practice of those in-between difficult. You just jump right ahead to super difficulty. Does that mean it's fully charged? The blinging? That's, the phone is fully charged, yes. Okay. Cool job. Yeah, the room 47 with that thing that goes up and down gets me every time. Yeah, that I was sure that I was going to die on that um, because you have like no control it's moving I doubt I'm going to do that well this time <laughs> that was very very difficult and I think just coincidental that I did not die with the moving obstacles <clears throat> so let's see And it's actually, I don't know if it's better or worse that I missed a letter because, actually it's probably better that I missed that letter. It depends. Um, because it delayed my warp, which got me to a higher level. But maybe it got you past your skill level. <laughs> it got me past the part that I would have. Yeah, no, you're right. You are, you are correct though, because it meant that you did more of the easier levels. Yeah. Less of the hard ones. Yeah. yeah. Ah! Ah! Dead! <laughs> That's why that beam is there. To piss you off because you missed your one chance. Yeah. Your, actually, you get two, about two chances to, yeah. to jump each wall. And then... But you can get uh, ahead early on by skipping walls, right? Ah... Uh, Unless I it think it keeps forwards. up with you. It right. does because when I warp, only get so far behind you. Oh what? yeah, yeah, it's, it's it stayed with you. I noted that. Yeah. So I think there's always a minimum distance. Yeah, that is safe distance. Yep. Whoa. Ten seconds to reach minimum <laughs> safe distance. That's definitely a trope. 
The well, uh, when was it started? Was it Aliens or Alien? I mean, um, that's probably the earliest that I know of. But I haven't watched a ton of like super early sci-fi. I definitely have countdowns in my book. Like an audible countdown that everyone from can robots, hear. From robots, yeah. From robot <laughs> voice. It's all like, doo -doo -doo. And there's at least two of them. But one of them is like, spaceship taken off. It's not really oh, scary. Yeah. I mean, that's a that's very expected. normal thing. Yeah, yeah. But the other one is, NASA... bad things are about to happen. Actually, they're both sort of spaceship taken off. Are they? Okay, well, that's kind of... It's the But one of them is you don't of... want the spaceship to take off, and so it's oh. like a self-destruct. Oh, okay. So. Well, that counts then. Yeah. <laughs> okay, now I've screwed up. Because now I'm in the... But I did miss the up and down things. That one's so... Ah! <laughs> See, now I got nowhere near as high. Nowhere near, I know. And it's still as hard. Actually, it... That's where I died last time, I think. Mm. That's what I thought. Yeah. That's weird. That's what I thought. Is that it... I couldn't get through that. Yeah. So the... The floor numbers are not corresponding... The room numbers are not corresponding... To actual room numbers. And it warps you but doesn't count it? That's very strange. That means it doesn't matter when you get it. Oh, try turning off the lava, yeah. That is, it is easier, but I haven't, we haven't really died on the lava too much. Only once in a while. Mostly the spikes. It's the spikes, it's really the spikes that get you, that I, I find. I haven't died on the lava. I have died on the lava, but I Not suck, anymore. so it doesn't really matter. You haven't died on the lava for a long time. And usually it's like a, a mistake. Like, it's not like, on purpose, like, oops, I screwed up, it's like, going through two holes and ending up so low. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna play one more time after you. Well, two one. No. Oh, that was just... <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's room one. <laughs> that was not good. Room one, and you tried. I was, well, no, I was trying to jump really high. Oh, okay. You're That's why. I, was, I wasn't just completely Some stupid. Tricky. I was trying to, like, Do optimize. And I deserve that. Whoa. It's too bad there's not a setting to turn off that little beam coming after you. Like, they could have used the black and white switch to do that. That would have been a cool option. To make it just a touch easier. Are we on the easy or hard? Mm. So I think we're just on easy. Because one's for lava, right? Yeah, we're not on hard. Oh, we gotta try hard then. It just makes the spikes and other obstacles come much sooner. Oh, it just advanced. Oh, that's not. Okay. But we will put it on hard. Okay. So it just kind of forwards you a couple rooms but doesn't call them <laughs> a couple of rooms. I think I know how to get over that. Because there is a bit of room at the top. Like, oh, <laughs> I don't know if that's good or bad because I know what levels I have to do, which is those moving things. Yeah. And I do not like those moving It depends things. on uh, how much you uh, care about building up skills. <laughs> I... Do not care about building up skills. Look, look, I knew it. I knew, like, it. I knew that would happen. <laughs> I had a plumb bob got you. You got murdered <laughs> by plumb bob. It does look like a plumb bob. <laughs> it's a strange word. Plumb bob. This is my last non-hard try. So I'm pretty happy with 58. Yeah, I'm really happy with... One? 23. No, one oh was not good. Oh my god. Feel the shame. <coughs> the shame of room seven. Okay, hard. Going for hard. Oh, it keeps track of best on hard. That's awesome. Lol, room one. <laughs> <laughs> Arena foot gave you a lol. 
Plum Bob gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> it did. It was bad. Uh -oh. I knew it was. I'm dead. I, I knew it was just chance that I avoided the Plum Bobs. <laughs> They're not named in the manual, so we're calling them Plum Bobs. <laughs> we are. Oh, the webcam is at a crazy angle. It wasn't me. I set it up nice. Oh, it's not much better. I'll switch the main camera on. Oh, you're on Plum Bobs. What the? Oh, this is hard. I was like, what the hell? Actually, it's really good practice because you get to them quicker on yeah. hard. So you can get, you can um, practice the higher levels without having to wait through it. Nice. <laughs> but I got jumps. to room 27 on hard. That's pretty good. Is that higher than... That's um, higher than the other games. <laughs> <actually>. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> Did I play twice? Yes. Okay, you can play then. This doesn't count. Oh, okay. It does count. <laughs> <laughs> Because it was okay. I didn't die. Yeah. <laughs> you were right to claim it at this early stage. Because if you said it didn't count and then you didn't immediately retract that, then you would not get to claim any high score that you got. <laughs> That's true. Because you can't do that. No. Nope. Rules are rules. Even against... when the rules are, are seem arbitrary and nonsense. <laughs> Plum Bob is timed up so that you can't just jump into that new room. I did. <laughs> do you think I know what I'm doing? No, I do not. <laughs> ah. So you have to kind of delay your jump into the Plum Bob room. Hard is not harder. It's just it is harder. Gets harder faster. <laughs> see, see. Oh, 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 oh. Plum Bob, get up! Oh no! There's no point in jumping. You want to give it one more? Yeah. Because <laughs> you do well on hard. <laughs> it's the easy levels I got you, right? That's right. <laughs> Uh-oh, better make it. Ooh, just cleared that. Gotcha again, yep, it did. For anybody tuning in right now, we're on our backup camera because our main camera Overheated, but we'll be turning it back on after this. Ooh. Oh no, you could do it. You did it. You didn't do it. <laughs> I didn't. I thought I just tapped it that time, but it didn't slide down far enough. One more game for me, and then we'll move on to Anguna. Anguna? What a strange name. I'm sure all will be revealed in the manual. Why it's called Anguna? Or not? Well, it seems like it's an adventure game, so it could be named. It would be wrong if it wasn't named something weird. That's true. But you have to make up some weird uh, fantasy name for your fantasy uh, land. It's probably the name of the land, right? That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. The land of Anguna. So if you named it like Richmond, <laughs> it's not like a very. You know, fantasy like name of the land. Oh right! Oh, it was boo. following me. I just I couldn't. No, time if you it had up. jumped right away, you would have been fine. But you, Do you, I get one you more? slid down. You go ahead. You have one more. <laughs> you get it. <laughs> the plum bob. Death by plum bob. 
This game is much I more I do enjoyable. like that I got further in hard than you have. <laughs> <laughs> That's a really good. That's idea. what happened last game, too. <laughs> what? When we are playing Ladybug. You got a higher oh, score <laughs> yeah. on the harder level. I don't understand that phenomenon. How is that? How does that work? It's just uh, you I'm, know, I'm 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 solid in the clinch. Let's see, oh, you got it. Good stuff. Yeah, you yeah. got this plum bob thing solved now. There's You're only good. Two of them. Thank goodness. Just need a J and Oh, a. you beat me. Oh, plum bob. Another plum bob. <sighs> Glad this is being recorded. No! Uh. <laughs> Another plum bob, I don't need it. No! Slooch! That was a good, good run though, 36. Yep. yep. It's very good. Let me just get this camera back on before we switch over. We're back, and hello, everybody out there. We are back when we're going to the third game. Uh, all the people watching. How many people are watching? Four. Well, mm, I Four. don't know. <laughs> Enough. Enough people. Four. Yeah, four is correct because we are watching. Yes. Be nice. I'm being nice. Be careful. <laughs> it's not worth it. I was trying to be helpful, but it's no. It's, it's not a being pain seen in the as ass. helpful. It's being seen as giving me stress. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. All right. I'm not doing that. No, don't. <laughs> The problem with these games, they're so the they're limited. <laughs> like if you get a box game mm -hmm. and they run out of boxes, that's it. They're usually not making the box game again. Yeah. And anybody who has one is not selling it. <laughs> so there's no chance of you ever getting it again. It's not like you know, something's made for the PS4 yeah. where there's five hundred thousand of them or whatever. I get it. Yeah. But yours would be special because yours is wrinkled the way yours <laughs> is wrinkled. <laughs> Not the way that the other ones are. <laughs> so we're moving on. Hi. <laughs> moving on to Anguna. Let's get this out. There's the cartridge. Pass that over. Disassemble this whole box. Now, we were debating whether to read the instructions for this, but we're not going to. And this is like an adventure game, so it's going to be a little bit more challenging. Icon. Oh. Or the image. That's that. No, nope, so the come image. Up. It'll come up. The image. Wall, oh, wall the, the image, yes. The image. The image. Change the image. There we go. Start password. Oh, oh, oh. This could be a multi session game. Mm. As long as it's, as long as you don't run out of lives, because that's hard too. But passwords, nice. That's what you need for adventure games. Especially in these old systems where they had no way of saving. Like up to like, I think, Super Nintendo. No, even Nintendo it saves. So before Nintendo, because there's batteries in some of the Nint Nintendo games, you had to have some sort of password system. Mm -hmm. And even on the Nintendo, they had password systems too. Yeah. To jump ahead or whatever. Um, but you definitely need it for this. Because I don't think that... Uh, mm, for that, like Alien. Oh, or Aliens. aliens. Yeah. Yes, for the C64, you had to write down passwords. Which was weird, because C64 worked on a disk. You I think, know. You think you could save... On the yeah, disk. Like, if they would let you have a password, you <laughs> they might as well just save it. Yeah, yeah, I wondered about that too. I didn't think you could. I didn't think there was any way at all because of that. Yeah. Oh, but they had tabs, so you couldn't alter the disk, right? On uh, the C64. So if it wasn't notched, you couldn't 
right. change it. So Anguna, it's your you have a little red red suited guy with a yellow belt and brown hair, and you have apparently is a sword, which is contradictory to no, <laughs> no you <laughs> what was on the it's cover? It's not a sword. It is laser beams. A it's very like it comes out of your eyes. A very short laser beam <laughs> that you have to raise your back hand this way. Oh, they're shooting! They're sh you're running into them. I know. Is that your help at the top? Uh, Left. I'm gonna it doesn't, die. Doesn't hurt you running into walls. That's good. That is a door that you can't go through yet. And they're back. <laughs> it's one of those games. Not a big fan of those games. What? Where? Did you stun that? Don't run into him. Hey, <laughs> He's stunned. Just, just, <laughs> just you, just Josh it. Uh, I, I, I get to play twice. Okay. Oh my God. Oh, no, I think I uh, hit password. Oh, there you go. Um, because on the cover, he had like a bow. But he didn't have a... He actually had arrows, but not a bow. So that could be those arrows. <laughs> He's stabbing the guys with arrows. What's that? Cherry. Health. health. Okay. So you're pretty full health anyway. Don't run into them. Don't get mad. <laughs> oh, you got health anyway. It's kind of like Mega Man where you get tons of health. That's good. And a key. Maybe that's for that the door. door yeah. Because it is a gray key. It's probably for Bye. the gray door. <laughs> <laughs> but the, the room passages reset until you kill the people. So there's the door, so I don't think you need to kill these guys. Unless you want the health back that you are losing by trying to kill these guys. <laughs> I know, but it is a game in which you get the loot, and you get the loot and it's not by full health. killing the monsters. No, no. It's just some health. Whoa! That guy sped up when he saw you. Ooh, he got mad. Uh oh. <laughs> I think he uh, probably didn't suffer. No, I think he gets reset. There, he's stuck. He's stuck. Get him there. Not that close. <laughs> <laughs> You're the worst. I'm a backseat driver. Backseat gamer. I'll have to shut up. <laughs> oh, um, no bonus. Did it open that passage? I think it. Well, it's reset now. No, the passage is always there. Okay. Bats. Bats. Ooh, patterned bats. <laughs> I'm gonna just die. Fel oh! <laughs> See, Fel I told you I would die. Wizard is about <laughs> to die. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna continue. Because those passwords are brutal. These guys only need one hit. That's not too bad. Like wormy guys? I think those are mouths or their tails. Looks like tails to me at well, first, but now mouths. I think it's mouths. I assume they were mouths, but he shoot, he's shooting in the wrong direction. Oh, he shoots in the direction he moves. Mm -hmm. well, that makes it easy. Ooh, speedy. Speedy, but not heat seeking. Just whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Still makes The sense. problem I had was uh, oh. controlling where the sword went. Yeah. It's... Like, if it only came out of my eyes, I could do it. But, like, then I'd move, and then, oh, now it's shooting the wrong way. Ah. And that was the problem I was having. Because it, the sword ends up in the direction you last moved. Uh, yeah, I know. I got that. But, like, it's still, like, I'm trying to move the guy and shoot. And the place I'm shooting is not where I want it to be. I'm just used to things being different. And I was thinking you could stand still, hold the button, and start going in all directions. Mm -hmm. like, that would be a good bonus, but they didn't do that. You have to move to change directions. Yeah. Like one of those things where you stand there and go... Yeah, yeah, like that, yeah. That would be nice, but it doesn't do that. But you can stand there and press the button, 
but it only goes in the same direction. I don't need to kill you again. I have the key, but I do need to kill these guys. Mmm, health. Ah, 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 ah. You probably don't have to kill them. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. I have the key. Oh, there is another... Is there another passage? Oh, now I don't have the key. No, you keep the key. Okay, good. Ah! Ah! Oh, they are... Oh, my God. They kind of go after you? They mad. They mad. They mad. Ooh, three hits? No. <laughs> you That's... did get health back, though. You It That's... just landed right where you were, so oh, it happened immediately. We stuck. Ah! Too close. Perfect. There you go. But you don't need to kill that guy. Unless you want health. Because he doesn't open up anything. Ooh, ooh, okay. Bats are just wandering around. But... <clears throat> so this is one of these games that it's the same every time. Most games are like that. Where it's the same every time. Not a lot of games build in randomness. That I've noticed. Okay, these guys don't shoot. And die with one hit. And do nothing. Ooh, this guy might give me a key. See, it's, he's at the end of a... Ugh. It's just sad when it's like the easiest guy to kill, but you still get hit. That guy opens a passage. <clears throat> so this game has pretty good... Um, Flicker management. Mm. I'm gonna go there because it opens up there. Ooh, passage. Any secrets? No. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty good animation. Ooh, a sword. <gasps> a weapon. Does. Oh, it's longer. Is it? Maybe. No. Might be. Maybe it's stronger. It's a bit longer that way for sure. Maybe it is a bit longer. It seemed like the laser. Uh, Oh, it's, it's slightly longer. It, juts it doesn't out. have to be much longer to be a big... I think it juts out more. That's what I mean. Oh, okay. That's what longer means. <laughs> no, longer means actually longer. Jut, just, oh, I, I don't know. It's like my yeah. my arm reaches longer. Yeah, you're, you <laughs> might be technically correct, but like <laughs> that's what I meant, was that you have more reach. I know. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> Pathetic. There we go. Always How many times did you hit that guy? Just twice. The blue ones only take one hit. Always go in the direction. I think those other yellow up. ones used to take more, though. That's oh, I, I see. Oh, I see. Yeah, I can't tell on the blue guys. Yeah, that's where you came from. Oh, I think I just went in a loop. Yeah. Okay, so I think there's some passages this way. Oh, I think I am. This is where I started. Think? Yeah, you're going back the way you, you come. Okay, so I haven't gone. I need health. Hmm. It's not that long. Hmm. How about this? Is he still going to be stuck? Oh. <laughs> I just landed on the cherry. Automatic. last time, too. I don't think these open up anything. Is he going to be pattern dude Ugh. I think it is stronger because I just took one hit oh those green guys always took one hit oh, okay I'm guessing you have to kill them here Ugh. okay baddies yeah it's nice having the sword it's the sword there we go ah Nothing. I think I need to make a map of this. Does he shoot? You gotta kill him this time. No. Okay. They did this on purpose. <laughs> See, you can you can just barely not wait, reach wait. him. Wait, wait, go back up there? Yeah. Shoot? No. Is it? No, no. Just, like, do you hold it? No. Holding it It just looked like it got closer, like further away from you. Oh, I see. Wait. See, it looked. Oh, it's just further on one side, is all. Yes. So, always. Kill from your left. I don't know if it's actually 
but it might be shorter. No, it's definitely f reaches further on your left. Hmm. Let's see. It goes almost to there. It almost reaches right across. Oh, almost right across when my head is one pixel in. And I think it's it's a, almost the same. Ah, oh, so fast. I need you to get stuck. Get stuck. There. There, get stuck there. Perfect. There we go. <laughs> Ooh, Ooh, finally, nine projectile! Nine of them. <laughs> now, how do I not use them? I don't know. I want to read the instructions. Can I read the instructions now? Yep. Because I don't want to waste these arrows. That's not a reason to read the instructions. <laughs> you don't want to waste these arrows. Like, you'll never get more. You can never play this I game again. I haven't seen any Yeah, but you should just arrows. restart it and play it again, and you get more. Yeah, but this took a little while. <laughs> okay, I'm going to skip to the arrows. This is a pretty thick booklet. You have been captured by monsters. Again? Yes, again. <laughs> How does this keep happening to you? This time, you are on a mission to kill the evil Goblin King. Switch to that. Oh my god, we were in full mode. I apologize. Can't see the game. Oh my god. Terrible. Sorry. I'll keep it. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, had to, you had to imagine yeah. what we were playing. <laughs> it was very exciting. It was, it was so exciting. exciting. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I'm just going to skip to the arrows. A uh, bow and arrow allows you to shoot arrows by pressing and holding the joystick button. Your supply is limited, and then arrows increases your supply of arrows. Now, do any of the um, Atari switches do anything? To view your inventory status and world map, oh, press the color black and white switch to black and white. The status screen will be shown. On the screen, you can view your health, attack, defense, power, experience points, inventory, and current password. Wow. If you're planning to take a break from playing, make sure to write down the password. Um, if you have a save key or Atari box, your password will automatically be saved to the device when you view the status screen. Nice. Okay. There we go. Oh, that's a weird map. Um, does not scroll. I'm guessing the white is where we are. Mm -hmm. So my sword strength is two. Armor is one. Nine arrows, experience seven. My health is seven out of 12, and I have a gray key. Wow, this is a, this is an in-depth game. There's six keys. There's a ring of attack, a dynamite, winged boots, a lantern. Allows you to see in dark rooms. Oh, that sounds terrible without the lantern. <laughs> Defense <coughs> power up. Oh, look at that. Well, that's, is this the map? It looks like that. It sort kind of. of uh, only one part does. of it does. Just the water. The water does. Oh, is this the map? The total map? It's the world map. The world map. Oh, this is what have we? That's very confusing. Uh, yeah, no, it's it did say the world map, and oh. so this, we're in the first dungeon, which is here. Oh, jeez. And then second, and then Goblin King's Lair. Oh, wow. Here and a here and a question and a question and many questions. <laughs> many questions in the map. Wow, this is a lot more in depth than I thought. Here, you can read that while I continue. Oh, and you can use a uh, Atari Vox or Save Key to save your game. Yes, I really need to dig that out. <coughs> but luckily, we can just put it on the screen and type it in after. Sounds like a terrible time typing that in. Oh, uh, the first player difficulty switch can be used to toggle between the player's sword being centered or off-centered. Oh. Centered. I think I like off-centered. You like having it's eye up high? lasers? Yeah, laser <laughs> eyes. Laser eyes. I found it uh, difficult because I kept positioning the body to get them and the body was not the place. Oh, that's how you use the sword. You just press it short. 
and the arrow is long. Ah. So, you don't, so you're not forced to. Yeah. But you've used uh, three of them. <laughs> yes, I have. <laughs> uh, hmm. Now, I... I have issues with games with maps. <laughs> because it's so hard for me to navigate them. Hmm. Oh, what was that? It's like a pea shooter. That's your arrow. <sighs> yeah, but it was like a dot going... Yeah, you know. that's what the bad guys... The bad guys were doing that, too. Oh, okay. So, vertically, it's just a dot. Oh, oh, now they drop more arrows, randomly. Ah. Okay, that's good. I, so I was thinking that um, you wouldn't get very many arrows. Ah! I need health. There we go. Um... Now I don't know... So people can see us play now, right? <laughs> yes. Okay. Thankfully. I apologize profusely. Sorry, Arena Foot. And everybody watching this later on. <laughs> now I don't know... Where to go. Or how that map works. Like, how does this map work? The map does not help you. The map no, is outside, not inside. That's oh. what we determined. It's the world but map, that, that not white, the dungeon map. That white score has moved within that black area. Yeah. So I think the black area is the dungeon. Yeah. I think. I die. Ah, uh, this guy's going to kill me. You don't have any arrows? I do. <gasps> oh my god. Get stuck. Come on, dude. Get stuck. <gasps> ah. Ah. Takes a lot of hits. One more hit. Oh my god. There's nothing here. I've already got the thing that's here. Yeah. Okay, the white does correspond to the rooms in the dungeon. Gotcha. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I need easy health. <laughs> oh, I see. So the save gear Atari Vox plugs into... Part two, I Part think. Part two, yeah. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Arrows! No! I think I need a room with just one green guy in it. <laughs> Not that one. <laughs> He's too fast. Or That's two. what all the green guys are. But the green guys are easy to kill. They are. They're fast, but they're, but they're these guys low are, damage. These guys are easy to kill. Yeah, but they I don't think. give you anything. Uh, One room did. I guess they give you experience. Well, yeah. Oh, they're stuck. That's fine. Let's see if they drop anything. It says some, oh, there are some secrets. Defeating oh, enemies might open doors. Some walls are fake. Occasionally you <gasps> can walk through what appears what? to be a solid wall. Oh. Use your map for clues and try to explore every room. Oh. So that might be a clue. That there's something on the other side of the wall. Oh, okay. So. Some rooms are dark. You won't be able to see very far until you find the lantern. Be careful. Enemies can jump out and surprise you. Ah! In the dark rooms. <gasps> oh my God. In dark rooms. I have you warned, you can't use your arrows to hit enemies that are hiding in the darkness. You will have to fight through a few dark rooms to find the lantern. I got all my health back. They, the, the bats do give you health. So I have good arrows and good health now. Um, I need to find... Like, how to get the hell out of this. Ah, 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 ah. So that didn't reveal anything. Ah. That's arrows, good.
Oh, you can get more than nine. Okay, good. So you can stack them up. I will say, oh, that's a new room, I think. So one of these is fake, maybe? No. Oh, I don't think I've been in these two rooms before. Maybe I have. So hard to tell. I need to write all these rooms out on a piece of paper. I'm just going in circles. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> How much experience do you have? I have... 10. So you're level 2. Okay. Do I need to, like, kill a certain number of guys before Def I can exit a dungeon? By defeating enemies, you will gain experience. At each level, in uh, increase your maximum health. Okay, maximum health. That's good. Oh, I found it. I found it. What did you find? The big dragon. Is that what you were looking for? It? Uh, something big. <gasps> whoa, 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 whoa! Yes. Nice. I still have health and my arrows. I did it! You're outside! Woo! Yes! <laughs> Finally. Use the in-game map to help you explore huh. every room in the, each dungeon. Power-ups are, are scattered throughout the world, which you don't want to miss. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the password on the screen. Just so this is the completion of the first dungeon. With decent health and decent arrows. <clears throat> Actually, I want to look at the map again. Okay, yeah. So I'm out in the grass. Yep. To, on the left hand area of the dungeon <clears throat> okay do you want to play now? no no you go <laughs> not everything you need is in a dungeon some items and keys are hidden outside or in small caves in the overworld Oh. Okay. watch and learn each enemy's patterns before attempting to fight them visit bitethechili.com for further gameplay help <laughs> bite the chili More arrows! Nice. I think maybe I will do some farming. About Anguna. Anguna 2600 is loosely based on the game Aguna for Game Boy Advance. Oh, okay. Started development of the original Anguna in 2005 and completed it in 2008 with the help of Chris Hildebrand's amazing art skills. Then I ported it to the Nintendo DS in 2008-2009. Oh, wow. Development of the Atari 2600 version began in mid-2014 and was developed at the same time as an Android game, Robo Ninja. So development began slowly. It is my first attempt at making an Atari game, so part of the process was learning the Atari hardware and mastering 6502 assembly. Did a good job. Mm -hmm. I, had learned on the r I had learned the rough basics of 6502 pro programming as a kid on my Apple II, but never developed anything other than my tiny test projects. And uh, the I is not me. The I is... Uh, <laughs> Mr. Dude? Nathan Tolbert. Ah. Uh, once I released Robo Ninja in 2015, it freed me up to devote more time to Aguna 2600, which thanks to the help of Albert and many other folks Albert. at Atari Rage... Atari Age. <laughs> Atari Rage. Atari Rage. Ah! Ah! <laughs> That's what I get when I die. It's <laughs> no. Atari Rage. Now you get to play. <laughs> I'm excited that Aguna will see new life on a new system and be played by new players. Hopefully we'll get at least a tenth the enjoyment playing it as I did making it. Now that I'm out of the first dungeon, I'm very happy. <laughs> Especially knowing that you can farm. <laughs> <laughs> grinding. Grinding for arrows. You have 40. More How many arrows do you want? 45. 45. <laughs> I want 99 arrows. Why don't you kill that snake? Because he looks menacing. I will go see the snake. Whoa. Oh, I'm moving fast now. I think I may have picked up winged boots. Winged boots let you move over lava and water. But I'm moving... Hmm. Maybe I increased a level? Ah! No, I <laughs> he came right at you, that one. <laughs> I don't like the snake. I like these blue things that don't shoot. 
And just sit there and don't move. Poor things. Maybe I'll get this guy because there's no impediments, too. Poor blue guy. Farming the blue guy. Oops. Blue guy's farming you. Ooh, my, ha my health is much higher now. Uh, yeah, would we press uh, just that? Yep. You have 16 health. 16. I don't think it was 12. 12 before. Yeah. What level am I? Yeah, at? let's see here. 59 arrows, experience one? That's because you've gone up a level. So you are at level five. Oh, you tell by the hit points. And you need 41 experience to get to level six. Oh, so the experience resets? To yep. one, and then you have to. Okay. Yep. Arrows. Wow. Remembers what was going on. Yeah, I was worried when I pressed the button, but I didn't <laughs> want to say anything. It was too late. <laughs> I earned that arrow. <laughs> Poor blue guy. Oops. I fed. Poor. Him. I fed him a bit before he gets destroyed. I just want to see how many arrows you can get. I bet it's 99. Or maybe they'll crash. No, he wouldn't be that bad of a programmer if he made this. I would. <laughs> you would just wouldn't check. You'd be like, yeah, no checking on the arrows. No, I would have more, more arrows than 99. 99 would be very achievable, I think. But I wouldn't make it an Atari. But is there, <laughs> you wouldn't make it on the Atari. No. <laughs> What? Did that stop? Did I get more? Yep, you got more. Okay. I think it just changed so fast I didn't notice. So many arrows. <laughs> if you can get more than 99, I will stop. I'll stop either way. <laughs> At 99. Six Two more. more times. That's the advantage of games that reset <laughs> each screen. What? Is that the easy guys respawn so that you can just um, just grind away and farming? I don't think Maybe I'm... you can't get more arrows <laughs> because it won't produce any when you have so many. Because you're getting... Yeah. Oh, there's oh. arrows. 99. You got to do it one more time, though. One more time to prove it out. Yeah, he was just <clears throat> giving me health. So much health. Nope. That's it. 99 is it, which is fair enough. I am fully stocked up. I will continue along the wall Wait. now. Yep. 16 experience. And 99 arrows. 99 arrows. Okay. So it doesn't show more on this screen. No. Or a rollover. Or I something. just meant that now you have a save code with 99 arrows. Oh, true. Thank you. More arrows! Plus. Is that an entrance? No. Ah, uh, snake. Kill that snake. No, I don't care about it. Kill the snake! It's Coward. With arrows? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Oh, no. What's Reset. the problem with... Uh... Ah! Oh, my God. Let's just ignore those things. They're just annoying. Ah! Get out of here. Ah! Ooh, okay. Is this water? Looks like. So the boots, you can walk on the water or walk yeah. on lava? And water. Okay. Yeah. So I'm going to go... North. What happened to your head? Oh, there it is. <laughs> I think I'm going to go south. Oh, these walls? Yep. Yeah. Okay. <gasps> oh. You can't get there. You can't get that until you uh, get your get boots. boots. Oh. I've hit, I've hit the corner of the map. Mm -hmm. Have I actually? Yes. Okay. Yes. Good. Bearings. I've hit the corner of the map, so I don't need to explore any further south. And I've got lots of arrows and lots of health, so I don't need to kill anything. Oh! There's a gazenta. Uh, another. A gazenta. <laughs> <laughs> what? So you call it when you can gazenta something. <laughs> oh. That's terrible. 
No, it's just what it is. <laughs> I'm going to walk along the bottom of the map. Oh, monkeys. No monkey murder. <laughs> nope. No need for it. Oh, impassable. Monkeys. Ah! Mm. Ah! ah! You can cross the river. It's your ford. Fjord. The river. Ah! Come it's on, not snake. a fjord. A fjord is... Uh, a jutting out of land? No, it's a... Jutting in of water. Jutting in of water. <laughs> <laughs> is it? I thought it was a it's jutting like out of the land. The fjords are like what we have here with all of the big channels. Oh, along because a peninsula is the jutting out of land. Yeah. A fjord is a jutting in of water. Yeah. But we call ours, in Vancouver, it is. An inlet. Inlet? I don't Broad know. Broad inlet, yes. Yeah, but. I think that they're. I think they can. I think they are fjords, but I'm, I don't know that they're fjords. I, I could be talking out of my butthole. <laughs> <laughs> Would not be the. Okay, first I'm going to go in this one. Uh, no, I'm not. You have to go through a couple of dark rooms before you can get your lantern. Did it say it the lanterns in the dark rooms? You have to go through dark rooms. Oh. Like I don't know that there's a lantern in here, but ah. <laughs> but you do have to go through here to. Uh, ah. Are you sure? You do have to go through dark rooms to get to the lantern. That's okay. all I can say. Okay. But I have to kill these guys. Probably, yeah. Uh, there's no end exits. I think ah. you're, gonna, you're about to die. I am. You're I'm getting die. out of here. I need some health. I think I'm going to go back to that other dungeon. Which other dungeon? The one I first ran across. Ah, I need the... Whoa, oh, big that's bug. a That's a boss. You get that boss. Get him. Sure he's a boss? No, oh. I'm not. He gave me nothing. Nothing. Gave you satisfaction ah. and bragging rights. There. That's who I want to see. This dude. Give me nothing. <laughs> Come on, blue dude. Give me some health. Just some health. That's all I do. He took my health. Thank you. One more. No, but thank you. <laughs> Much appreciated. <laughs> ah, no. <laughs> Need that shield. Upgrade my this armor. Yeah. Upgrade my armor. Whoa. Arrows. Ah. Ah. What's the chat say? Anything new? No. Okay. Good job. Good job. Thank you. <laughs> I guess that's for getting out of the dungeon. Maybe. Ah. I'm not doing well. What do you mean you're not doing well? Because <laughs> I keep losing my health. Oh, yeah. That's, that's how I do it. <laughs> Losing it while trying to gain it back. Yeah. Come on. Oh. Okay. I'm happy. Let's go find that. Find that dungeon. Uh oh. Should I kill a monkey? Oh my god. I can't believe you stabbed a monkey. <laughs> You're some vegan. <laughs> ah. I'm not going to eat him. <laughs> <laughs> it's just murder. It's not. It's only murder. It's only <clears throat> monkey murder. Oh, trap myself in a corner. No, yeah, you go up though. Uh, I don't think this is the corner. I think I'm like in a little area. Oh, I do need to go up, I think. Yes. This. No. Just go in for a sec, you'll see. Ah, oh, that's where you started. This is not what I want. I have to kill the dragon again. Ah. At least he's kind of easy. Where was the other thing? Mm. That way? I well, know. I went around, down, I went right, down, yeah. left. That is how you do it. Yeah, and then it was towards the bottom there somewhere. Yeah. Yeah, you okay, I see. To. So I have to go around, and then around, and then down, and then over. Yeah. That, but and then up. No. 
keep going over? I don't think I went over enough. I don't think you went that way enough. No, I didn't. Oh, no. tree. <laughs> well, the forest, those trees, they Thick do forest. block your path. Ask Frodo Baggins. That's true. There you go. Where is that? This is it? Yeah, I think so. Oh, okay. Whatever. Ah! Kill him! Ah! Did he give me a lantern? No, no you have to go... Th it was like... A f it said you have to go through a few rooms. Okay. Well, at least not all and the rooms And it did not say that you get a lantern past every dark three rooms. It just said that in order to get it, you have to pass through rooms. Okay. Ah! Give me health. I need to exit. You only get one life in this game. It's very scary. I need an easy target. I think I'll go with the snakes. Ah. I think the snakes Ooh, are easy. No, they're too fast. That's my dude. What happened there? I think you got some health and arrows. Yes. I think I might have killed him by being on him <laughs> a couple times. Okay, now I'm happy. Ish. Nothing there. Nothing there. I think I need to kill the guy. Where is he? Is he stuck somewhere? Is he not even here? Is this dungeon consisting of one room with a key? But uh, he would be what there. They all respawn. Yeah. Maybe some glitch. There he is. Ah. Okay. Nope. Up here? Nope. Is that is this the whole thing? It could be. I guess so. I mean you did Maybe get a key. That's and true. the key is useful. Like there's six keys in the whole game. Oh that's so true. This is where you get one of them. Okay. There we go. Ah! Ah! Ah. Good. Okay. Well that was an easy dungeon. I will go to the other one now. Not before getting some health. Oh, two guys. Tell me, Mr. Blue. <laughs> That's what I like. Go to the other dun dark dungeon. I'll avoid killing the monkeys. Hey, get out of here. <laughs> get. So I have to cross this. Ignore that, because he's not really a boss. Or maybe he is. Oh, you can go there. Or maybe not. No. No? No. That's weird. Strange coloring. It is. What? What? Ah! What is that? Ah! Where's no, that? No, you, you go, go kill down. him. Wait, 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 wait. Go back out. Okay. <laughs> Save. This kind is our save. save, sort of save. <laughs> our filming the save. <laughs> That's true. And I can just write it down later. Takes a while. Okay. Oh. Ah! <laughs> oh, he's patterned. Oh. He doesn't actually really go after you. He does pause. That's when I'll get him. Ah! Ah! Come here. Do my arrows go through? Yes. Ah! I know they reset every time. I know. I know they do too. <laughs> get, get, ah! Uh. Come on. Ah, oh, bastard. Got him! Yay! Oh. <laughs> this gives me nothing! <laughs> oh well. Go up. That's okay. And then over. No, because it, it wasn't that far. The no, 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 I mean, now down. Oh, oh. Okay, oh. It's like a, a woods and foresty area yeah, with maybe. spiders flying, flying. Oh, this is like proper maze. You can go up. Hmm, there must be something in here. Or nothing. Or maybe it's like a mountainous area. What is that? Hello. 
Can I kill you? Nope. <laughs> what is this? weird? Like a blobby thing. Ah! Ah! And then down. Hello. Impasse. Impasse. I need the boots. The boots of walking. Yeah, maybe. Ooh! Ooh. Uh oh. Castle. Just a like, sec. Let's, uh. <laughs> just like the final castle? I think it is. I don't think you're ready. I don't think I'm ready either. Even though you're quite high a level. Yay, it's nothing here. <laughs> I haven't found a secret passage yet. Yeah. Dragon. Easy dragon. I'll stay in this place. That's what I needed. A little bit. Oh, I need the key. It's the pink key. Purple pink key. Yep. Okay. Well, I know now. Where's, where's this? Top left. Top left of the map. Go down. Uh, I was down. I was. Oh, okay. I came from down. I think. Gotcha. I did. Did I? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. There's nothing to do there. Da, ba, ba. Snakes. Ah. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Poor guy. Stuck there. <laughs> I need to find that other dungeon. That was it past the water? Was it on it was on that side of the water. Mm. That second dungeon, I think. I thought it was over here, but go down again and go over there. Yeah, there it is. Okay, good. I thought it was this on this side. The, yeah, this is the one. Yeah. Ah. And you had to have to kill them because you tried all the places and oh. there was nothing. Come here. Ah. Oh my god. So hard. You can't see where they are until they attack you. Come on. Bouncing back. I gotta get out of here. Run away! <laughs> Run away! Where's the nearest health dude? Nowhere. I, yeah, I could kill these two of them. They're not the worst things in the world when you can actually see them. Except mm -hmm. I'm going to die. Except in you're going to die, yeah. They are much worse than the blue... Blue guys? I don't know where a blue guy is. Ah! You're... you're... What's that? Did your camera freeze? Yep. Why does it have squares around our heads? <laughs> uh, that's its way of doing focus. It's just funny that it froze that way. <laughs> <laughs> that is funny. Why is your camera overheating so much? Because it's a hot room. Hot room. That's, that is, it is not that hot. No. I don't like hot rooms. It's not that hot. Hmm. I don't know. Like, how did you film, like, stuff with that? I didn't. Oh, that's, is, that's is this Tanya's camera? Yeah, that's uh, Tanya's camera. Because your camera is too big, or what? Uh, it my camera only outputs 720p. This uh. output, outputs 1080. But I'm also outputting at 60 frames a second, which can be making it hotter than before. Yeah, why are you doing that? Why don't you do 30? I will switch it over to 30, but it needs to cool down now. But it didn't even say, please shut off to cool down. Hmm. It didn't the first time either. Didn't it? Oh yeah, yeah it the did. First it, time the first it time I did. did, the second time we just saw that it was gonna need it. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Password? Okay. That's the password to the last game? Or is this for inputting? I think this is for inputting the password. I wonder if it's got CRC checks. What CRC checks? Are you just making stuff up? Yeah. Because yeah. <laughs> if it doesn't, it'll be like a random game, but I'm sure it does. So that you can't just put in random stuff. What CRC checks? So if you have a... Why is it... I know what you mean, but what is... How what does is it, it work? Um, say you are... Say it's a two-digit yep. code. And you put in... Actually, let's switch it to... 
so say it's a two digit code that you're putting in. Mm -hmm. Actually, let's make it three. Three digit code you're putting in and you put in a zero and a zero and the third one is the um, the check bit, the CRC correction bit, um, except you input it instead of it storing it. Um, so you would uh, add them together. Right. Zero plus zero and it's expecting a zero. And if you put a one in that last bit, it's going to say no, that's not a valid thing. Right. And if you put a one zero zero, it's invalid as well, or zero one zero. But if you put a zero and a one, it's expecting a one. So right. that's a valid code. Zero 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 is valid, zero one one is valid, and one one um, one one zero. Yeah, one no one one zero is valid because there's it overflows. So the first code the first codes are the information and the last one is just to see if you're making shit up. Yeah. Yeah. So I just made shit up and see if it worked. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> <laughs> so it knows. It, I mean the guy's not that dumb. Now, do you want to play? No. Or we're done. We're done. That's quite a. That's too long. That is a long game. We yeah. will continue. It's very cool, that. though. I think we'll continue that at a later date, because I, I got pretty far. I got two keys, two keys. I think. Yeah. I got fair a fair distance. So, fun. Did you like the games today? I thought they were really good. Actually, I thought they were all really good. Yeah. I mean, obviously, the last one is totally solid. Yeah. Like lots of work put into this, yeah. like so much work. <laughs> yeah. I at first I didn't think it was going to be that complex of a game. I thought it was like, oh, you shoot arrows and things, and you Kill get stuff, yeah. hit points, and you go to another room, and you keep doing it over and over. Not like, oh, there's six keys and five dungeons and all these things, and a and a weapon screen. Because at some point I was thinking, oh, I should make a game like this. Now it's already been done. <laughs> I don't need to make it. There's no point. I won't be improving it much over this. This is pretty pretty good for an Atari, like, you know, RPG. Yeah, it yeah. is. Yeah. 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 It doesn't have a lot of um, text, but I don't think it needs much text. It's got projectiles. It's got melee weapons. It's got things that shoot, things that don't shoot. It's got bosses. Yep. Dungeons, Overland, like what it would. Yeah, yeah it was need. great. It was great. Yeah. I was really impressed that it had both uh, dungeons and uh, map world. Yeah, real yeah. world. Head world. Um, Ninja. Ninja Jump was really good. I thought it was really fun. Yeah. I am not one to necessarily like all <laughs> of the uh, scrolling games. I thought this yes. was really good. Platformy type yeah. games. I like that it was. Mostly just pressing a... It was all <laughs> pressing a button and yes. how long you held it. Variation of button pressing. That was great. Yeah. Um, and uh, Ladybug... I think uh, that was the most challenging I found. That was, like, hardest. Um, I liked it better than Pac-Man, but I don't like Pac-Man. <laughs> <laughs> so, so high praise, then. So <laughs> <laughs> better than a game that I don't like that is similar. <laughs> It's got more stuff going on. I'm not kidding though. I liked it. Like, if Pac-Man was like this, I would like Pac-Man. Yeah. <laughs> I like that you don't have to keep going. I mean, I know that that's one of the things people like about Pac-Man, I guess. But I. Yeah. Anyways. Oh, Arena Foot, you missed Ladybug. Sorry. Um, you can check out. Um, I'll be posting this in a couple days, after I make sure it's not all effed up from, the sync stuff. out of sync stuff, but. <laughs> Are we still in sync? We wouldn't be in sync right now because we're using a second camera. Yeah. But anything, anyway, most of it was in sync and we missed some of the Anguna, which sucked. <laughs> we were just playing, actually, a lot of it at the it beginning. It was just the beginning, like it was all repeated, so just skip yeah. that part where I was playing and you'll be fine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, Wall Ninja is awesome. I like yeah, I liked Ladybug. It was, um, yeah. it was pretty fun. Not like one of those that I would. I'd come back to it actually quite a bit, but wall the wall jump ninja I would come back to quite a lot um, because we certainly did not hit the limit of what was going on in the game. Yeah, I yeah. think we just started to hit like those moving things. I'm sure there's more obstacles than that. Um, and of course, Anguna has tons of replay, or at least 
one full play through it, which yeah. we I think maybe got a fifth of the way through. Yeah, maybe not know. even that. I don't, I. It's hard to judge how far we were. I mean, yeah. Based on keys, there was yeah. we got two keys, but we didn't get. But you only got one power up. Yep. Uh, for attack and no power ups for defense. Didn't get a lantern. Didn't yeah. get winged boots. Didn't get dynamite. And you obviously need winged oh. boots to get some of the. Uh, oh yeah, that's to get the boulder. Boulder. Yeah. Yeah, you need to get the winged boots to get to certain places, and the ring of attack definitely. Oh, for your fight with the goblin king. So you definitely that's yeah. the last thing you need to get. Yeah. So I don't even think we got one sixth of the way. Maybe one tenth of the way. But that uh, that is very very well done. Um, so good job, um, Nathan Tolbert. Excellent. It's basically, it was what I was hoping that it would be. Yeah. It fulfilled what I was hoping it would be. It was so more than I good. thought it would be. And it is more than I, I thought it, it is more than I thought it would be. Yes. <laughs> and everything I hoped it would be, yeah. but I didn't think it could be this I good. Agree. Um, there are actually text, Atari 2600 text adventures out there. <laughs> That's crazy. I mean, you can't type text, but it's like mul limited choice, like north, south, east, west. Use the joystick to select. I didn't buy that. It looks so boring. Because <laughs> <laughs> I was just looking at it going, nah, I don't know. So maybe one day I'll get that. But there's many more games before that. Yeah. Um, so that's it for this week, I think. It um, is. Because we're boiling in here. We have very bright lights shining on us. And I think I got all the problems fixed from last week, except one new one has come up. Yeah. Because I'm now using the camera properly throughout the whole thing. Yeah. Um, but it might be because it's at 60 frames a I'm, second. I'm sure that that's... And it's working harder. That's got to be it. Because otherwise, <laughs> I mean, it's not, it's not doing anything you would expect to he overheat it just by recording video. Yeah. yeah. No. So... I'll solve that last one problem as long as the audio is fine, which Arena Foot says it's fine. So we'll was... just uh, blame Arena Foot if yep. it's not. <laughs> That's right. It's your fault, dude. But uh, thanks for everyone for joining in. Um, you can check out um, Ladybug and oh, what the heck is the next batch of games? It depends on who. Like if it's. Like, if, if it's Tanya, I'm going to get my wife in on one of these. She loves puzzle games, so I'm just kind of holding off on some of the puzzle games. Um, but if it's... It's probably going to be Darcy next Friday. I don't know. Are you going to be here next Friday? Next, maybe, maybe not. Next Friday I won't be here, but two Fridays from now I will Good. Be. That's an opportunity for me to do... Because I'll be here next Saturday, but not next Friday. Okay. So I'll do puzzle games next time. Um, probably... Uh, let's see. Assembloids, which is a really new game. Um, toy sh maybe Toy Shop Trouble? Because I'm not going to be able to wait till Christmas <laughs> <laughs> to do all the Christmas themed games. <laughs> That's kind of an action puzzle. Well, we, last time we did a Christmas themed game, so. That's true. Yeah. So. You just redo them. No, don't redo them. S maybe stratagems. That's like a matching, dropping. Strato gems. Oh, Strato -gems. I see what they did. There. Strategy and gems. Uh, marble craze. Maybe marble craze. Not really a, Not a puzzle. puzzle. It's more like moving a ball through a maze. Oh yeah. So sort of like marble madness, ex right, except those. Right. You know those physical ones where you move a marble. Like labyrinth or whatever. You, you tilt yeah, it. Yeah. Yep. You're actually tilting it with two paddle controls. Oh. Looks crazy, but. Yeah. No. I would hate it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I will. I would hate appreciate it. it. I might and hate, hate it. it at the same time. Um, and maybe I'll see one more from somewhere. But we'll see. Some so those two at least. Um, so I hope you like this one. Will the show be later in the day? Yeah, it's not in sync. No, it won't be in sync. I'll I'll, I'll fix it. One second. I'll fix it. <laughs> I'll fix it in post because we're using a different camera right now than the proper camera. So blah, 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 it's like we're dubbed. <laughs> so let's see how far off it is. This will actually help me in post. <laughs> so editor, me, fix that at that part and do, do. sync up the clapping.
<laughs> what was it? Uh, I paid 60 bucks for my Ladybug LE, limited edition. Yes, these games are $60 US. <laughs> these are very expensive. These are more expensive than PlayStation 4 games. Because <laughs> I'm in Canada, Vancouver, Canada, or we're in Vancouver, Canada. And so I'm paying like, with shipping, $80, $85, $90 sometimes for these games. Uh, uh. <laughs> it's brutal. It's brutal. Uh, Maria Foote says that uh, they're writing a book. Oh, yes. Yeah, Arena Foot is writing. I've, I've talked, I think. Yeah, you can switch that off. <laughs> We've got the password. Is it you that I've... You're, you're the guy writing a book um, on homebrew games, doing the homebrew game collection book. So that's very cool. And just message me uh, when you have more updates and I can put them on the zero page homebrew uh, Facebook and social media stuff and looking forward to it. It's very cool. And we're still broadcasting? Yes, still recording. Excellent. That's At least exciting. that keeps going. That would drive me crazy. Cameras, hardware, I can kind of figure out. Yeah. But um, so thanks for everyone for watching and we'll see you probably next Friday and earlier in the day. 3 p.m. in the night. afternoon on Friday is an odd time for people to tune in. Yeah, that is an issue. Um, that's West Coast time. But um, it will it will be later on in the evening next week because Tanya worked during the day. I'm a bum. I don't work during the day. <laughs> I do other things, film stuff. Um, I work at home. How about that? <laughs> so I can do it any time of the day. We're both bums. We don't have jobs. <laughs> so we'll probably be at night which will be a little bit easier. But Friday's still a bad day. Bad day to do live streams. So maybe we'll do it earlier in the week, like a Wednesday. That's usually the peak day when people aren't doing things and are staying at home. And uh, yes, I'm writing the homebrew games book. Yes, thought it was you. Okay, so thank you for everybody for tuning in. And uh, we will see you next time. This doesn't have a set schedule. So keep watching the page and hopefully you're home and if you're not home watch it on youtube later there you go oh i also check out the unboxing video that i did uh that i released today <laughs> <laughs> if you're watching live it's today on the 9th <laughs> of uh some of these games we played and a bunch of these games up here that i got recently and my prize did you see this last time yeah you did okay well so we showed this last time and my prize from getting levels into Draconian. Ooh, which is an awesome game that we played last week. That's, yeah, of course. Because we played it last week. That's why I showed it. So we're signing off. And see you next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Quick, press the button before it's anticlimactic. Anti <laughs> this button? That button. <laughs>